All right, Coach, 1-0 defeat to Kansas City here at home. What's your take on the game? You played them even for 70-plus minutes. They, they sneak one in the 74th. Uh, obviously, that turned the tides, and the, the first goal seemed like it was going to win. Yeah, we, we, we just got to find ways to score goals in games. We can't go two games in a row playing 200 minutes and not put a ball in the back of the net. We're just not going to be very, very successful unless we start doing that. Uh, I thought our kids were, were definitely affected by the 110-minute game on Friday night. You know, we didn't use a lot of subs in, in that respect. We went a little deeper on the bench in the first half looking for a spark and, and just didn't quite get somebody to, to step up like we were hoping to. Um, but, yeah, it, it was credit to them. I mean, you know, they, they kept uh, being physical out there with us, and, and uh, you know, we just didn't quite step up like we needed to. But uh, we've we got to find a way to put a ball in that. Defensively, it seems like your team is really starting to hit a stride. Uh, it's two goals allowed in the past three games, including Friday's shutout. What is it you like about the group that, that's come together in terms of keeping the ball out of the net? I think that number one, Gigi's did a good job. She made a couple saves today. Again, they kept us in the game. There was a nice shot they had that uh, she held on to on a, on a good just far post shot that there was a kid there to crash the goal and put it away. And she did a great job of holding on the ball. And that was something that in, in years past, and even in you know, the beginning of the season, she was letting that ball go. And, She's just doing a good job of elevating herself. I think that Pierce and Kelly and Lauren are, are doing a good job of staying on the same page back there. We went just three in the back today to, to go against their formation. And I thought that uh, they did a good job of being physical, stepping and challenge from the ball and, and trying to work the ball in the back and just staying organized, keeping playing for them. Now, lastly, it seemed like you, you mixed up some form formations today and, and tried a couple of different things to, to get a spark offensively. What was it that, that may have worked, you may have had some success with, and where did you see the struggles as well? Uh, I don't think we had as much success. You know, we were trying to mix things up, looking for that success. Mm -hmm. Just weren't able to kind of find that final pass, getting somebody to go into, into the game. It seemed like when we would make that final pass, it was either too far in front that she stretched out and, you know, just merely making a touch to keep it out of bounds or from going out of bounds. And, uh, or we played it behind him and just didn't play it in stride like we needed to. There was a couple balls, and we, we had Taylor and Callie running at them in the first half, and Callie didn't quite, I don't think Taylor could find her, and then when she finally was able to find her, Callie was off sides in that play there. There was a couple in the second half, we should have played a little more in behind him to give her a chance to get running, and we just didn't connect like we needed to. All right, thanks, Coach. Thank you.